Hello there, Gemini. How's it going, you guys? It's time for your reading. Looks like a really interesting read. It doesn't look bad at all, really. <clears throat> Not in a, as far as looking at the bigger picture, it looks really good. Yeah, my name is Kelly, by the way. And uh, let's get started. Um, and the first dream you have here is Gable. This is talking about blessings. Blessings and gifts. So I feel that, uh, you know, the sun is shining over here. You have the sun. And so I'm feeling that, um, you know, uh, you're very, very, you're very, very, things are looking very, very clear to you. The reason I say that is, you know, with the sun here, to illuminate your blessings you know you have the ace of swords here and Gemini I don't know if you know this or not but if you know anything about tarot but swords represent our thoughts okay so the, this represents your thoughts and this is seen really clearly this is like on the verge of a new beginning a wonderful new beginning and being able to see very clearly and I also feel that uh, when I see this card, I feel that you're, you know, you're very anxious for new opportunities um, and a new situation to unfold before you. And that's what you're trying to do. You're actually, you're learning something as well. All right. So this is really awesome. Okay. And, you know, I see Nathis right here. Now, Nathis is a, is a rune that is talking about learning. Uh, you know, I see you learning something for sure. Um, also, Nathis is talking about uh, a lacking. So, you know, maybe some of you are lacking some money or something, all right? And it's left you um, a little unhappy here with Wang Yu in reverse. But you know, for uh, this is kind of a complicated read because I feel that there's a, 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 a wide range of Geminis that are watching me. And the reason I say that is because I, when I see the runes the way that they are, it's indicating uh, different energies for different people, okay? So, for example, now I see Ewas here in reverse, okay? Now, Ewas in reverse can indicate a partnership or something. Some sort of a partnership that you don't feel that that partnership is being faithful to you. Okay? And with Wang Yu in reverse right next to it, it's like this could actually be a possible breakup. This could actually be a possible breakup. Uh, for some of you, all right? Now that's kind of weird how I'm picking that up energy up, but now this is, uh, for most of you, Wang Yu is just kind of like feeling a little bit uh, sad because you, you're lacking probably money right now. And that's probably the majority of you. That's probably why that's there. And with Iwas in reverse, it, it's talking about a few things. Ewas can be uh, that maybe now is not a good time to travel because you may run a, you know you may run into some uh, obstacles if you have to travel. But uh, Ewas can also be talking about uh, the need to uh, not work yourself to death. I mean, if you're really kind of like a workaholic and you're just working and working and working and working just to try to get that money. Um, you know, this is saying to just stop stop it and, and uh, don't bring yourself out, all right? It's not going to do you no good. It's not going <laughs> to, it's not going to, you know, work. This is also talking about substance abuse. So, you know, um, you want to keep a clear mind and, you know, uh, especially if you're drinking alcohol or something like that, I would advise I would I would advise against any alcohol at all. 
because it, it, it'll take away your clear mind. You need to keep your mind clear. You've got this Ace of Swords. This is a great opportunity coming your way. And you don't want to miss out on that. All right? And especially when you have Inguaz right here in the middle of the reading. And Inguaz is a very potent uh, reading. Um, I'm potent <laughs> reading, potent rune. And Inguaz is something very positive propelling you forward, all right? Uh, it's very, very positive, all right? It's next to Othala, and Othala is like someone in your family. Someone, someone, you know, I feel that you're going to be around family, all right? I feel that you're going to be around family, uh, Gemini. And I see transformation. I see major, major transformation. All right, major transformation. You have you have uh, Digaz here twice, not once, but twice. And as you can see, it's shaped like a butterfly. And you know, butterflies transform. You know, they transform from a caterpillar to a butterfly. Major transformation. Digaz also is talking about uh, material gain. So, you know, I feel that, you know, you're going to be, if you're lacking some money now, Gemini, that's going to turn around, okay? Things are, tra things are changing, all right? Things are changing. Um, and also, I wanted to throw in the fact that EWAS in reverse can also mean that many of you uh, are not feeling... Um, or actually believing that you can do it or believing in yourself and this is saying uh, you know to believe in yourself because you can all right so as you can see with Wang Yu and Iwas together it makes quite a different combination it can be you know very many different scenario <laughs> you know from possibly some of you actually breaking up with someone to uh, just maybe having some problems getting, you know, traveling somewhere or, uh, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a wide variety. So <laughs> I hope I touched on the one that is that best relates with you. You know, it, this is just a general reading, and so that's why I pick up so many different energies. Um, yeah, but it's kind of cool how I do that. I can see that. So anyway, let's pull you a, a moon a moonology card. I already pulled it here. And the one that uh, I pulled is Full Moon in Aquarius. Be real. All right? So, Gemini, be real with yourself. Be real with yourself. I mean... You don't have to worry about what anybody else, you know, just be real with yourself and know you can do it. All right. For those of you that are not feeling that you can do it, you can do it. All right. All right there, Gemini. Well, anyway, I hope you enjoyed your reading and I hope I was clear. You kind of figured out which which scenario best uh, fit you. <laughs> and I will see you guys again next week. OK, Gemini. All right, then I'll see you later. Bye for now.